200G for network operators means um, a couple of benefits. It uh, comes down to um, operational savings and capital savings. The 400G cards actually will be flexible cards. The 400G cards are not only providing 400 gigabit per second, but are software definable cards. They provide 100 gigabit, 200 gigabit, so they are switchable in bit rates depending on uh, the reach. In terms of inventory management, you have to take care of fewer types of line cards because one line card can address um, many different bit rates. Um, that makes it simpler inventory management and results in cost reductions. Another operational savings portion um, that comes with 400G is um, associated with the power savings. With the single fiber we can transport more data. That is important in terms of if you think about all the new services like uh, cloud, video applications, online gaming. So providing capacity at a lower cost that is what uh, 400G is uh, doing in terms of uh, benefiting carriers. We do R&D in terms of further improving the technology we have, um, trying to improve uh, the 100G technology we have and um, also uh, 400G technology and even look at the one terabit technology with uh, the aim to provide a better performance than our competitors. As an example, I can tell you that we are certainly looking at the Nyquist filtering technology to squeeze neighboring channels very tightly together, which gives a high spectral efficiency and then a high transport capacity per fiber. Adaptive modulation for line side cards means with the digital signal processing technology we introduce at the um, receive and transmit side, we do have the ability to change the modulation format. Means we can not only do QPSK, which we are doing now for 100 gigabit, we can do more complex modulation formats like 8QAM to realize 150 gigabit or 16QAM, which means 200 gigabit in a single line card. So that single line card then provides multiple data rates and those data rates can be switched by means of a software command from the outside. So we really have a flexibility here means that we have a software defined optical transceiver technology. A lot of thought goes into the solution before we put the Fujitsu name on it. Fujitsu equipment is known to be very reliable, it is long lasting, it is very easy to deploy, it is very easy to install and to operate. For the 400G solution, that will be certainly compatible with the transport equipment we have developed in the past and which is deployed in the field. So the 400G will just provide a means to get more capacity out of the installed infrastructure. 